Hey, this is Matt Wimmer from Brody Precision. In this video, we are taking a look at a new offering for us here at Brody, a brand new option when it comes to your networking remote access solutions, one that I think is going to bring you a whole bunch more opportunity and uh, flexibility when it comes to getting into your buildings from remotely uh, and managing and accessing those things as you need to. And that brand is Teltonica. They are a very large manufacturer of remote access solutions. So think routers with cellular capability, uh, routers that maybe just plug directly into Ethernet if that's what you need, uh, 5G, 4G, switches, uh, really, really low cost offerings. Um, a lot of flexibility, a lot of options there. So uh, in this video, we're just going to do a brief, brief overview, a little bit of an unboxing. And then uh, in future videos, I'll show you exactly how to set things up and how to make this work for you and your customers and your coworkers so you can get into your buildings and manage things and access things as you need. All right, so here we have an RUT241. This is their best-selling model. Gives you a WAN Ethernet port, a LAN Ethernet port, and a SIM card. Spillway is a uh, cellular-capable device. And we're just going to take a, a look inside here, what you get out of the box, and uh, what that experience looks like. So the first thing to look at here is on the side, we have a QR code, which has a whole bunch of information that you're going to need, especially if you're using their RMS solution, which is the remote management system, uh, which allows you to get in remotely through the cloud, as well as... Uh, manage your device itself so manage those ip settings uh, manage firewall if you wanted to port forward you could do that kind of stuff all directly from the cloud interface so you're going to need some of the details here this qr code has all of those details inside so very easy to get the um, information out instead of having to manually type all of this in so that is printed on the side of the box but let's uh, actually open up the box now and inside, we've got this, which is a quick start guide. So we can get into uh, one of the things that I really, really love about Teltonica is their documentation is great. They have a wiki on their website, which has detailed information on how to do just about everything that you would need to do with your Teltonica devices, including set up VPNs, uh, manage the devices using their RMS cloud solution, all of that jazz. Um, so that QR code will take you to the quick start guide. And then as well as this one will do the uh, remote management website and then get you there and get you up and running. By default, the remote management solution comes with a 30-day trial. And then after that, you can purchase a subscription. But it's not a recurring subscription. So you just buy it as a 3-year, a 5-year, or a 10-year. Very, very reasonable prices on those. Um, another thing that I really like about the Teltonic stuff. And then if you're going to use it um, for a VPN, you will need uh, a, some data package uh, with that as well. We'll go into the details of that in a future video, but um, just so you know it off the top. Uh, so that is our quick start guide and information. Just a little bit more details about what's in the box and that kind of stuff here inside. Put that away. Then next on top of that, we've got our antennas. This uh, device, as I mentioned before, does cellular as well as Wi-Fi. So you've got two mobile antennas for your cellular and then an antenna for your Wi-Fi. We've got a CAT5E cable. This is only a 100 meg uh, router. So our LAN and our WAN ports are only 100 meg. So no need for CAT6 or anything like that. So the CAT5 cable, the CAT5E cable inside. And then we get to the actual router itself. Super, super, super tiny, as you can see. And I have small hands. Um, a little bit of information on the outside, what your default IP address is. Then we've got our ports here on the side. Uh, we've got our, uh, let's see, our WAN port on the right, our LAN port, port on the left, SIM card slot, indicator lights for what our cellular signal is, and then our connection for power. And then on the other side, we've got reset button, and then our antenna jacks to uh, get plugged in and get access to the internet. And then 
we've got our power brick um, and then on top of that we also have a little sim kit depending on the size of the sim card that you get from your carrier you may need to use one of these carrier uh, adapters to get that sim card to fit in with what the uh, RUT241 actually wants to see and then a sim card uh, insertion tool uh, basically a fancy paper clip so that you can open that up and get into it as you need um, and then the other thing I forgot to mention is on the back of the um, RUT241, there is all of the details that we mentioned that are on the box plus more. So your default username and password, um, the default Wi-Fi, SSID and password. And then again, a lot of that information is available to you just by scanning the QR code. The other thing, it's, it's kind of silly, but I, I, I appreciate the detail um, in this, is that this is laser etched into the actual case. So um, it's not like on a sticker or something that's going to get rubbed off specific information or uh, peel off in some kind of way if you're moving this device around from site to site. So uh, that is also very nice. And rugged aluminum construction on basically everything that you're going to get from Teltonica. So hopefully that was helpful and informative for you. Um, we're going to have a whole bunch more information and videos coming here. We're basically starting a new series of videos here on Teltonica and the usage and uh, how you can get it off the ground and running with it, um, especially if you're coming from something like uh, TaziBox, which I should also mention the RUT241 is a very, very nice um, replacement, even though it's no longer available. The Lock 175, which was super, super popular when it was available, this RUT241 fits in really nicely um, in that spot that the, the 175 created. So thanks as always for watching. Stay tuned for more videos on Teltonica, and uh, we'll see you in the next one. Thanks.